Hello and welcome to Ash Reviews in English and a TLDR look at the plus sound Allegro where I force myself to say something good, something bad, what I think is the best and what I think is the worst, all in my opinion of course. And you can find a lot more by checking out the full review which is linked in the description or just head over to ashreviews.com. Okay, so something good. Um, the build and the aesthetics are very good. Um, I mean, not just the IEMs, but also of the included accessories, etc. The build is just, it, it's, it's excellent. I have no complaints about that whatsoever. The bad is the comfort. Um, as you can see, these use, they're, they're a large set of IEMs. They are on the large side and they have these sharp edges around here. And they, this just digs into the top of my ear and it makes them very, very painful for me personally, even after a few minutes. I mean, not even after long extended times. Um, I've tried multiple different sets of tips and I did find that getting a seal a bit further out of the ear helped, but I still found them uncomfortable after a while. And that that's a bad thing. I mean, it's not gonna affect everybody, but they are on the large side and they do have some sharp edges going on up here. The best, in my opinion, the best, the lows and the mids. Um, I find that the lows and the mids just work very well together, um, especially for acoustic and vocal centric music. Um, great timbre in my opinion, everything sounds very natural, they seem to work very well, nicely detailed, and just a, a very good presentation of one of my favourite genres of music. The worst is the upper ranges. Um, the upper ranges, the sibilance, there are some peaks there, um, some things just come across as too harsh, and they can be irritating in, in the upper ranges. Um, not on all tracks, but especially when there's like uh, hi-hats or other percussion going on or some snare hits in some songs, they can get mm, just too spicy up there and, and become uncomfortable. And I guess that's it. Something good, something bad, what I think is the best and what I think is the worst. As I said, if you want to know more, check out the full review, which is linked in the description, or head over to actualreviews.com, and I'll be back with another one soon. See you later.